I, 35 female, started my tattoo sleeve and my husband, 34 male, is mad because another man, quote unquote, marked me. <laughs> Did I do something wrong? Another man imprinted on me. <laughs> yeah, he's an alpha werewolf guy. Yeah, he's an alpha. All tattoo artists are alpha werewolves. True. Yeah. That is true. They all have uh, wolf sonas or whatever yeah. it's called. Too long didn't read. A husband upset. A man. A man tattooed me. <laughs> That's the too long. Does, didn't does read. he also get mad when like uh, another man bags the groceries or like you know like other mundane tasks? We're gonna get into that. Okay, good. I recently started a traditional sleeve. It's going to be pieced together, and I found a really good parentheses male artist nearby. I don't know many women in my area who do traditional style. I really like his work, and he had availability and great prices, so I just went for it. The first one I got, my husband was fine with. I told him before I reached out to the artist, showed him his Instagram, showed him the flower I was getting. After the appointment, I called to let him know it went well, he was cool, and he's a power lifter and we talked about the gym a lot. The artist had missed a spot and had let me know to come in and he would give me a good price on my next one. So I sent him a couple of things and made an appointment for two more, parentheses, my arm felt so incomplete with just one. Uh, My husband knew about this appointment. The day of yesterday, he was very distant. Sorry, this is very all over the place. No, it's all good. I invited him to come with me, but he said no. So I left, got them done, and came home. Now it's been almost 24 hours, and he has not really spoken to me. (laughs) What? Yeah, I know. Does he also not wear purple shirts and uh, (laughs) not wear uh, uh, lip lip balm? balm or whatever it was? Today he came to me and said he's upset because I let another man mark me forever before he got to mark me. What? Wait, wait, what? wait, hold on, wait, 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 I missed that the first time I read it. Before he gets to mark? What is he gonna do? He's not a tattoo artist. What is he doing? Um, he knew I wanted a sleeve. I've been showing him pictures of tattoos for months. He knows I have, <laughs> I have had issues with my body my whole life. He knew I never felt confident enough to be myself and do the things I want to do. And he was happy that I was finally trying to become the person I always wanted to be. My Instagram is literally full of girls working out traditional tattoos and girls working out with tattoos. I've wanted them for years and I'm finally doing it. Edit. He is not and has never been a tattoo artist. So what, yeah, what does he mean by Mark? I don't get that. Is he going to brand you? Yeah, that doesn't sound good. Like you're an animal? Like you're a like a fucking pledge at a fucking uh, 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 fraternity. Yeah, what the hell? No, anyway, uh, I chose this one because someone else has seen uh, <laughs> there's another post on r slash not how girls work because there's a guy who thought his wife breastfeeding their daughter would turn her into a lesbian <laughs> because the daughter's sucking on her nips. And apparently someone had commented that there was another guy that was upset that his wife, like he tried to get the internet to agree that his wife was cheating on him because she had let another man, quote unquote, suck her nipples or suck her her tits when it was their son. (laughs) What is going on? Okay, all right, y'all need to chill. Y'all need to fucking relax. The levels of, fellas, is it gay? (laughs) Well, this is a gay for another man to tattoo your wife. <laughs> if my baby girl is breastfed, will her odds of being lesbian increase? How do I make it stop? My wife and I just had a girl. Our first was a boy. He is now three years old and he was breastfed. I had no problem with the breastfeeding. Oh, weird. Weird. So you're, <laughs> cool with, you're cool with incest, but not lesbian incest. If, I, this, if this is your own logic. <laughs> The levels that homophobia reaches is crazy. It's wild. Now with a baby girl, I figured she would be breastfed too. I had no problems with that until I saw her being breastfed. It's been about two weeks and I can't get rid of this feeling that she's going to turn out to be a lesbian. She really attacks my wife's boobs. Why are you thinking about your child this way? Yeah, that's you perv. insane. It you is weird. It is weird to think Christ of breastfeeding is sexual. Almighty. More so than my boy when he was a baby. It just doesn't seem right, and I can't help but wonder if this is how lesbians are made? Question mark? No, God makes them. <laughs> I fear she will be a lesbian if she isn't bottle fed. Does anyone have any advice or experience here? Is this an act of lesbianism? What? <laughs> what? Should I stay pissed at my wife for what she's doing for my doing to my child? The arguing is getting intense. I hate the idea of someone's tits being forced in my baby girl's face. Oh my 
God. Jesus. You, we need to ban Reddit. You need to get shot. Yeah, some people, yeah, someone. <laughs> you need to get taken out <laughs> yeah, back. Yeah, no, sorry, guys. Shot. This is not okay. Yeah. What is going on? You need to be put in the gravel pit and shot. There was, a, there was a similar news video, I actually do recommend it about, uh, the title of it is just, Are Men Okay? And the answer no. is no, yeah. Yeah, it's the answer. Yeah, it's a great video, go watch it, yeah. Because I do, because I, like, okay, I do Imagine care about, like, um... <laughs> you're in college, you see a guy across the library, and he's so cute, and you go up to him, and you hit it off, and you go on dates, and you're in love. And you get married. And you get and married, you're together for years, and you get married, and you move in together, and it's all perfect. You have a baby boy, bouncing baby boy, and you have him, and he's and you're he's such a good dad. And then you get pregnant again, and this time it's a girl, and you're like, oh my gosh, I'm living my dream. <laughs> yeah, you get your, this is my American dream. Yeah. This is, I want... Two, two, two point five children, yes. and the picket fence, and, and the, the dog, and everything, yeah. and you're about to have it all, and you're like, "This is amazing! My life is so perfect." Girl. You give birth to her, and you start breastfeeding her, and then he's like, "That's gonna make her gay." This is fucking. Gay. Wait, hold on. Wait, are you? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Hold on a second. I'm pretty sure this is um, gay as last hell. Last I checked, I wasn't dating a lesbian, and I'm not gonna have uh, my daughter become a lesbian. How fucking <laughs> dare you be gay in my house? To my daughter, you harlot. Like, all the context has flown out of this guy's mind. Yeah. Anyway, the Reddit, the actual Reddit story, yeah, your, guy, your, your husband's a freak. A fucking weirdo, How yeah. is he gonna mark you? What do yeah, you mean? Yeah, what are you fucking talking about, yeah. Is he asking for, like, a cum shot? What do you mean? Yeah, you just, yeah like, that's, that's not what that means by branding. Does, that's, he, does he want you to get his name as a tattoo? Because that's a red flag. That's also a red flag. Don't. Don't you fucking dare get my name. Well, I mean, <laughs> I'm like, not getting your name. If you have the name of someone, I don't care. I'm not against that. I know there's some people that are weird and judgy about that. I couldn't care less. I don't less. give a shit. Do whatever you want with your body. But I do judge men that are like, get my name tattooed on you. Because yeah, you're that's mine. The, yeah. I think, I was trying I to, think that's weird. Yeah, I was trying to say earlier, I guess, like, yeah, like, this is what all the, like, the, the, the some more news videos, like, making a point about, like, this is what the right wing, like, you know, like, uh, patriarchal men dipshits. Yeah. Uh, uh, this is what they cause and it hurts them and they don't even yes. fucking know it yeah for sure because like yeah it's like this is ridiculous this is fucking <laughs> what are we stupid. talking about yeah. we're just having stupid conversations yeah and uh, yeah god none of this is like there's like she just needs to be fed that's yeah. it yeah that's the that's the yeah, worst breastfeeding is not sexual yeah. no it's not it's never been <laughs> it's not sexual Jesus. I, I even kind of understand the idea of like trying to make breasts not sexual because I, I kind of get it. Yeah, I agree. That being said, they're great. It's not. <laughs> no, the breasts are awesome. Breasts are awesome, yeah. I, I feel that too. I feel like early on after realizing that I'm gay or mm. I'm pansexual for the people that don't understand, um, I'm pansexual and like I experience attraction. I think for a long time after that, the only experience with... Um, uh, w being attracted to women was like sexualizing women, mm. and even now I'm like, eh. it's a little. No, I get it's it. It's weird. Yeah. It's a little weird. Yeah. Sometimes it's weird. I mean, I will say, like, if you're two consenting adults and you're sexualizing each other, I'm. I don't care. Yeah, no, I get it. Yeah, as long as everyone the involved. Well, has that's the consent. thing. Is like, uh, but you shouldn't be walking around the street and ogling a woman. Yeah, that, that's that's the, the, that's the two important things. It's consent and context of yeah. like you know. I think that's where my brain kind of is. Where it's right. like, yeah, if I see a baby breastfeeding with the mom yeah. or anyone, it doesn't matter. Yeah, like, yeah, I'm not gonna sexualize. I'm not gonna her. sexualize it. If I see, if I just uh, see a woman that's really hot, and I'm not gonna ogle her and make yeah. her uncomfortable. Now, if I'm on porn.net <laughs> and then it's and then it's well, like I mean, these like, big old we're, boobies we're sexualizing each other yeah or if i'm yeah like, we're yeah, giving like, each other consent to sexualize each yeah, other that's, that's not our problem yeah exactly yeah yeah in the comfort of our own home yeah private, and everyone yeah. has consent yeah exactly yeah. yeah out of the eyes of our cats because they can't consent yeah <laughs> But yeah, you that's know. just wild. Yeah, the marking thing is so... It's weird. I would never... I'm even iffy on, like, if we were to get married, like, taking each other's last names, because yeah, I'm kind of like, I don't... Don't take my name. Well, I'm also one of the only, like, one of the last O'Hearans, yeah. female O'Hearans. Yeah, so, like, I don't want to, like, we're going take out. that from me. Yeah, you guys are... I'm not giving it up. I'm yeah. sorry. No, that's fair. Yeah, I get it. I'm yeah. giving it up Chinland. I'll be the last... I'm, I don't even know how many Chinlands there are. Well... 
There's like one actor that's named Chinland or something. It's like you and your sisters, right? No, my sisters don't have it. Oh yeah, they they're, don't have it. Born from a different. So name. it is you. So I should take your name then, technically. Nah, I don't do Make it. Make the Chinlands go. Nah, we we die together. <laughs> Our names die together, Sarah. Okay, I'm fine with that. It's romantic, I guess. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> <laughs> This is weird. But yeah, yeah, no, weird. That's so weird. Yeah, fuck that. I would break up. Never under. I, I would, would break too. up. Actually, that that's might be. Thing. That's a controlling motherfucker. If nothing else. And also the switch up. The switch up is like, yeah. He's totally fine until all of a sudden he wasn't. When yeah, he saw like, you after you got your first tattoo, he saw you happy. Yeah, and then it was like, like another I man. Stop another this. man made you happy. Get out of here. <laughs> It's like, who fucking cares, man? That's why, yeah, that's why I was saying earlier, like, the, yeah, do you get mad at the guy bagging your groceries? Do you, right. get ma- do you get mad at all the people that stock the food? Do you get mad at the Amazon right. driver, the yeah. Amazon warehouse worker, uh, the fucking, uh, <laughs> just any man? Wasn't it, we read something that it was like, uh, I don't like that you're enjoying this food because what if a male chef made it? Did we read something there like that? There was something like that that I saw, maybe. Let us know if we read that. I don't, I don't remember. remember. And it was like, how do you know how that you, it's yeah. a man versus a woman? Like, he just assumed all chefs are male. And I was like, what if it's a lady back there? Ooh, lady chef. Lady chef, yeah. You think it become chefs now? What Ridiculous. <laughs> it's just super weird to, like, old, like, Puritan misogynist ideals like that somehow people you have still have still. to yeah it's weird like it's fucking 2024 it's just chill out yeah. women can have jobs whoa wow and credit cards can you imagine and own homes no i know <laughs> it'd be your boss it's like they're people <laughs> <laughs> okay <laughs> all right that's weird solved it yeah. oh, god there's your thumbnail <laughs>